Could 30,000 animals fit on the ark described in Genesis? That's a good question. Glad you asked. To answer it, we have to take a look at two more things. The size of the average animal and the size of the ark. Makes sense? Of course it does. Moving on. We can't list every animal, but we've got things from the various bird kinds to the elephant Elephant. kind, from the various dinosaur kinds to the smallest mammal kinds, and so on and so on and so on. So, you take all the young adult animals, because nothing says the animals had to be the oldest and biggest, and you look at all the various sizes we know of today, even from the fossil record, and you do some calculating, you come to the conclusion that the average size of the land animal is actually smaller than a sheep. But let's just use a sheep as the average size for the sake of argument. So now we've got the size of the average animal, a sheep, and we have the maximum number of sheep, 30,000. So are we going to need a bigger boat? Well, let's see how big it really was and if 30,000 sheep could fit on it. Back to the Bible. Genesis 6.15. The length of the ark shall be 300 cubits, its width 50 cubits, and its height 30 cubits. Genesis 6.16. You shall make a window for the ark, and you shall finish it to a cubit from above, and set the door of the ark in its side. You shall make it with lower, second, and third decks.